It is a really scary moment for any parent losing your child in a sea of thousands of people. It is something that happens every single day at the Houston Livestock Show and Rodeo. And as families enjoy all things rodeo at NRG before the season ends this year, staff members say their busiest days are still ahead. KPRC 2's Devin Clark showing us how to keep tabs on your kiddos throughout their fairgrounds and what to do if you get separated. Just like there's a lost and found for things like your keys, there's also a lost and found for your kids. It's located right here on the first floor of the NRG Center between halls A and B. And on a day like today, you found out just how much it's come in handy. It's the worst feeling in the world, you know, and uh, just to know that, you know, you are uh, supposed to be responsible for uh, this person's well-being and then in the blink of an eye you know they could disappear. Sometimes it only takes a moment. This year alone we've had um, 124 lost children on site. Um, we have a 100% return rate of course so that's great. Sharon Garrett, chairman of the Directions and Assistance Committee says this morning was the busiest for reuniting lost children with parents at the Houston Livestock Show and Rodeo this season. We had a shift from 8 a.m. to 4 p.m. Yes. with 40 people on staff here today and they had 22 lost children just today. Uh, that's not anything any parent wants. I've thought about it. Like I'm always, always on them. Just hey, don't don't wander off, man. Staff recommends that before families enjoy the rodeo, they come and get one of these green wristbands because, as you can see, especially on a day like Family Wednesday, it's pretty easy to get lost in the crowd. We ask them to put their name and their phone number on here, as well as the child's name, and then they can secure that to the child. Lost and found staff say if you do happen to get separated, make sure your child knows to look for law enforcement or staff wearing a teal vest. That we are approachable, mm. so that we don't scare any children, and we can talk to them. And we've all been trained on what to do. While kids wait to be reunited with loved ones. They wait in a safe space, watch a movie, play with toys, and even get a light hypoallergenic snack. Extremely important, especially during an event like this and it's spring break. It's a lot of kids here, so you need to be very uh, uh, aware of where your kids are. The Lost and Found area stays open until the fairgrounds close at midnight, and we're going to have the number where you can reach them on our website, click2houston.com. Reporting from the Houston Livestock Show and Rodeo, Devin Clark, KPRC 2 News. Got to stick together in those big crowds. Devin, thank you.